Brian, uh, just get some comments on a uh, great week for you. Um, it's hard to put into words. Um, pretty unbelievable. You know, I've had so much great support this week. It's been uh, it's been awesome to be able to play in front of everybody here in Michigan. Big ovation there on 18. What did that feel like coming up, coming up there? Yeah, you know, uh, making that putt was uh, pretty special. Um, you know, it's you know it's probably something I'll never forget. It's pretty pretty cool. How's it going to be going to your next PGA Tour event and not have all these people around? <laughs> it's going to be quiet, I think. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Probably just back to normal. I'm I'm used to the other way. This is not uh, normal for me, so it's uh, it's pretty cool, and you know, hopefully, it can do it a couple more years. Pleased. I mean, you have to be obviously at the one rough round, but you have to be pleased on the whole for the week. Yeah, you know. Um, or not. Y yeah, I mean, I'm I'm pretty pleased. If you, if you told me I would have shot 17 under, I, I probably would have taken it before the week started. But uh, you know, it's it's been awesome, and. Uh, I don't know. Pretty special. Coming in, you said yesterday you thought maybe you'd be four or five, six back. Uh, you're looking at a little bit more than that coming into today. Uh, were you surprised by that? And, and then what is your focus at the beginning of the day, knowing that it's probably not going to be a win, but uh, there are still things to be, to be gained out there? I, I mean, I wasn't surprised by it. Uh, he played awfully well yesterday, and uh, you know he's continuing that today. So, you know, I, like you said, it was kind of you're playing for second pretty much. So it's kind of. Uh, you know, you're just trying to make as many birdies as you can and try to get up as high as you can. Brian, talk about building on this, heading down the home stretch of the season. Sure, you know, it's it's definitely a nice confidence boost uh, going into the FedEx playoffs. So I'm looking forward to the next couple events and then um, getting started at uh, Liberty National. What is how, your next event? how much are you going to miss this crowd? Uh, I'm going to play John Deere, take it next week off. Yeah. yeah. How much are you actually going to miss this type of crowd, though, considering you haven't experienced it before? You know, yeah, I mean, it's uh, it's it's awesome. Like I, like I said, it's pretty special. And to be able to play well on top of it, um, it means a lot. Many of the players have raved about how quickly uh, the fans have taken to this tournament and growing the, the scene here locally. Um, do you think in a couple years this could be definitely a marquee event that a lot of players come to and also builds, uh, builds upon with the fan support? Yeah, no doubt. I mean, the, the golf course is great. Um, you know, I, I think you saw that uh, when the Buick Open was in Flint. Uh, crowds are always awesome, right? So, you know, I think it's everybody is excited to be back. PGA Tour in Michigan, so it's uh, it's pretty cool. How much do players talk amongst each other about, um, you know, hey, I played this event, you, were, you know, you should probably maybe check it out next year, or you know, this was good, this was bad? Yeah, I think, um, you know, a little bit. Um, the, the guys who have played certain places and know a little bit more about it, I think um, I would imagine a lot of guys are going to be uh, raving about this this week because it's, it's just such a great golf course. And, you know, it's um, like you said, it, the fans have been great. So it's pretty awesome.